it's no secret that electric vehicles are different from traditional combustion engine vehicles. You see, EVs get fueled by transferring electricity from a source to a battery. That's obvious, we all know that, but what we may not know is how long it takes to make that transfer can vary depending on a number of factors. Where a traditional gasoline tank can be filled from empty to full in about 10 minutes, an EV can vary anywhere from 15 minutes to 12 hours to go from empty to full. And this is where the opportunity is for businesses. Because you see, if a business can recognize that an EV operator goes through their day with a mindset of topping off versus filling up, then a business can see the opportunity to offer chances for these EV operators to top off while visiting their business. And that's the big idea here. If you can create spaces where people can top off their EVs throughout the day, then you have an opportunity as a business to put your parking lot to work. But how do you get started? Well, it starts with a level one, a level two, or a level three. A level one charger is the entry level for EV charging. It operates at 120 volts and 12 to 16 amps. It's the most cost effective on the electric bill. However, because it's using less power, it's also the slowest. So a typical EV will take about 12 hours to get a full charge. A level two runs on 208 to 240 volts, pulling 12 to 80 amps, and can fill up a typical EV in about two to six hours. A level three is the biggest and fastest charger running on 208 to 240 volts, pulling 70 to 350 amps, and converting from AC to DC to deliver DC power directly to the battery. This charger typically can provide a full EV charge in about 15 to 45 minutes. Now level one chargers are good for the home where you can plug in for a while and just let the car charge. Level threes are good for charging fast, but they have a high price point and they can be costly to maintain in the long run. The best option for most business owners is going to be a level two. This charger comes with a good price point for the property owner, but also provides the EV operator with a good value for the money they spend at the charger. And that's the real opportunity here because electricity isn't free and it's fair to ask someone using that electricity to pay for it. Businesses can install EV chargers in their parking lots, set a price for the electricity that EV operators are going to use to charge their vehicles, and build a revenue stream off of those chargers working in their parking lots. Now, how much revenue depends on a number of different things. What type of charger installed, the price of the electricity there in the area, and the price the business operator sets for that electricity. Other factors come into play. Rebates, incentives, things like this can all help offset the cost and help build a quicker ROI. Electric vehicle charging can be confusing and complex. But at FSG, we don't think it should be. We've built a business around helping business owners and operators understand what their options are when it comes to offering EV charging solutions to their customers, their employees, and the community as a whole, and make a real difference and a real impact in the world.